Today, we're in the herd with cross country. Having gone 20 days without competing, the Bison will be in Loretto, Pennsylvania this Saturday for the St. Francis Invitational. Coach Kevin Donner says this has been a non-traditional schedule for the team this year. Traditionally, we like to race every other weekend, but we started the year off with uh, two back-to-back -back races, both on very hilly courses. Then we went 20 days without a race where we were really training hard, especially on hills, and uh, now we're going to go and uh, see where we're at. He says that he's seen his team evolve over the last 20 days. A lot has changed within our, the team dynamic. A lot has changed among the order of our, our team. Some people are pretty fit right now. And uh, the one thing that I am really pleased with is uh, we're very healthy. After winning the individual title in the Detroit Invitational in her last race, the Bison's Caroline Tolley was named the Patriot League Runner of the Week. And she says she and her team will be ready for this weekend. I think we're coming together really well. We've gotten in a lot of hard work the past few weeks um, with the break from racing that gives us a chance to um, put together a string of really hard workouts in a row. So, um, yeah, I think we've, we've really uh, built on the base that we created at the beginning of the season and um, things are shaping up well. On the men's side, John Dugan was also the Patriot League Runner of the Week after winning the men's individual title at the Detroit Invitational. He says the hilly course at Loretto this weekend will really get the team ready for the Patriot League Championship meet October 27th at Colgate. Coach Donner talked about before the season how he wanted to set us up to run that league meet to the best of our ability. And even though our schedule might seem a little bit unorthodox based on the distances are running, um, we're getting a tremendous workout just by racing on, you know, even if it's a 7K, we're getting more than an 8K workout because the course is so difficult. Um, and not only by comparison, but also by like getting used to the feeling of running that kind of terrain, I think will definitely prepare us more so than, you know, running a bunch of flat courses.